So this afternoon we've come out to take a look at this bungalow here. Uh, it's in Sherbourne Road, which is on the Horringer Court Estate. Uh, this particular location is really nice. You've got a pathway uh, which takes you down to a riverbank and in turn uh, to a path that takes you towards the town centre. So that's really lovely. Uh, you can just hear the birds singing away. Uh, now this chain free property will need a little bit of updating but it's certainly been well maintained. Uh, so let's go inside and take a look. So you can see we're just in the entrance hall now. Uh, behind me is a useful cupboard. Straight ahead there is the sitting room and just panning round now is the kitchen which we'll go into first. So as you can see we're now in the kitchen. This door here is to the side of the bungalow and you can see you've got worktop surfaces and cupboards and uh, just above there in the corner you have the gas-fired boiler. Now you'll see as you go around the bungalow does need a little bit of updating but it is uh, in good condition. You've got replacement UPVC glazing for example uh, so that's a cost you don't have to worry about but uh, just looking at the kitchen again plenty of appliance space uh, so definitely something you could work with I'm sure. So as you can see we've now come into the sitting room. Uh, sitting room is large enough for a dining table as well. Uh, so good sized room, uh, fireplace there and then uh, what is really lovely is this big picture window here which I'll uh, show you from the other side. Here we go then. So this is the same room from the other side and you can see how lovely that picture window is because um, it overlooks the front gardens which are lovely in their own right. Um, so you'll see one or two people wandering past just walking their dog. It's not a busy area but there is a bit of activity going on which of course is quite nice to see. So next we're going into one of the bedrooms. Um, both bedrooms are double rooms so it's hard to judge which one is bedroom one and which one is bedroom two. They're a similar size just a slightly different shape. So that's one of the bedrooms there. And then the other double bedroom is just here. Uh, quite often find that people change one of the bedrooms to a separate dining room and then have French doors which would then lead out into the rear garden. So that's an idea. But equally, uh, if you wanted two double bedrooms, uh, these would definitely work for you. And then finally, the bathroom has been converted into a shower room, which a lot of people find easier. So that's that just there. And just to show you, the garage is behind the property is actually the light blue coloured garage. And then just to the side, uh, you have parking as well. So plenty of options for parking. And finally, just to show you the rear garden. Uh, now this area is very private. It should also get a good amount of sunshine, just judging by which way it's facing. Um, and then this is the back gate that leads to the garage. Uh, now the garden, you think, oh, it needs work. In fact, it's packed full of shrubs and bulbs. So give it another few weeks and that should be looking beautiful. Um, if you'd like to come out and take a look at this property, do that by just giving us a call on 01284 755 26.